Shalom guys, I hope that you are doing well. Thanks for joining for a element sign reading. So if you are returning, welcome back. And if you're new, listen, my channel looks at a lot of hardcore energy. And the very first reading that I did was water and fire. And we had like a murder and a fugitive that came out and some 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 real hard stuff was coming out. Okay, so you will you will hear some stuff that could be disturbing to you because I do look at criminal activity. Most of the time I'm targeting that stuff and so just it's just inevitable it's gonna come out on my channel. So if you say you'll just learn me as we go, you could hear something though that could save your life as well. Okay? Because there was a secret wish there for death, for somebody secretly wanting to ruin somebody and that is just nastiness. Anyway, um, so this is kind of what my channel is about. So I love the great one. You will get scripture here. It's found in the tarot. I'm not ashamed of Jehovah Elohim, maker of heaven and earth. He is our Yeshua, our salvation. He deserves all praise, glory, and honor. But I'm not churchy or religious, but I do keep all ten of the commandments, okay? Uh, I'm just for the truth, and I hate wickedness. And so I just uproot it in the earth. So this is who I am. You'll learn me as I go, like I said, as we go, <laughs> like I said. So welcome to the channel, though, if you stay. And thanks for checking me out. you got to go away. All right, Jehovah, who do you want to address? So we have water and air. Air. Okay, well, I just did the water and uh, fire, so some of this energy might intertwine what came out just a minute ago. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to take the past, present, and what's fixing to, you know, come up in the future. We'll also see what's hidden. I will take a um, card on each one of the cards that come out, and then I will take a rune and an extra card from another little deck um, for the outcome and some words. For, the, for your reading, okay? Well, there's the past already coming out, so there's water. So in the past, something, you know, I will say that in that other reading, we had arteries coming out, and there was a murder there, okay? Um, so somebody was hung up, and somebody's into the stupidness because we had um, a Moloch worship come out in the... Um, words okay so we're dealing with somebody within your energy space that's into the occult into doing things to people okay um that ain't cool okay if your religion hurts another person gotta murder other people something wrong with your religion okay because a living elohim does not call for you to kill people you are you willing to die why would you make somebody else die Okay, that, that, this is a crazy card. This is a psychedelic card. This is, this is a kook then. Okay, in the past something's very poisonous. In the past somebody's just sit there and contemplated something, hanging around trying to figure out something. This is backwards organization. This is stormy waters with this card. So something within your energy was re really sacrificial or somebody really did get sacrificed. Okay, in the past. So show me um, cards for the now and the future and then what's hidden. You will you just... Cut this deck, please. Whatever needs to come out. We have the work. Something's over. Okay? Something's ended in a very big way. In the future, we have some type of messages or quick travel. This is also an investigation card. Okay? Uh, what's hidden is the Empress. And the Empress was in the now in that uh, water and fire reading that I did. Okay? Uh, the King and the Queen of Pentacles was there in that reading. Um... Something about children are here uh, because the rune came out that also clarified that situation. We had child sacrifices and stuff like that. That would be here. Um, yeah, there's craziness and there's consequences of what somebody's done out here within some matter. Okay? The gardener was there as well. Let me take another card. I'll use those for words. So, Jehovah, so I was stating on that other reading that uh, if you have a garden... And, you know, there was a widow that was there as well. There, 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 somebody could be buried in the garden, okay? we got family and stuff like that here and people that are in that stupid Moloch worship, okay? Because uh, it's showing it out, out here. So there's, there's, this is hidden. Somebody's mother's hidden. And somebody's mother's hidden. Or somebody's project's hidden. Or some money is hidden. We had a, had a bunch of money that was there within that energy, okay? Some law could be hidden. The empress can represent law. Um, this somebody's family member could be here. That's hidden. Give me a card, please, Jehovah, for each one of these positions. You just cut it for me. By the way, the song in the background is The Day That It Rained. All the vocals are my vocals, and uh, it's an original. Uh, we have the King of Swords. Okay. So, so if you, somebody did go through some type of a divorce or there's just some, 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 some type of a, 
the King of Swords is anything from a divorcee to medical to um, a police officer, a judge, a lawyer, just somebody very sharp, somebody very skilled. There could be a professional here. The twelfth house goes back to projects and stuff as well, and so does the Empress, and she's hidden. So some type of project would be here, and a professional in the in the in the uh, past for some of y'all then would would be here. But some some type of crazy issue, and somebody's detached is out here. That energy is also here. Something's over though in the now between your energy um the knight of pentacles this is about something so the knight of pentacles is slow and steady wins the race i'm checking the details of something if this is prison and then that's a prison card as well we have law that's hidden all right and he this would also represent law as well this card is also can mean something finally arriving that's been taking a long time. Something's finally closing out and something is here. An older person would be here with the world card. And it also would go back to bank systems. A boss could also be here. So if some, somebody that's hidden is a, is a, is a feminine boss somewhere and something's happened. We're also told in scripture that the world... Uh, is is the um, it's also referred to like the garden as well as well given that we're in the harvest and stuff spiritually speaking this is a very spiritual card as well with the hangman it has a meaning of prophecy going on and so at a bigger level in a, in that dimension spiritually then then I pull that energy in here and, and we're seeing a lot of crazy stuff going on in the in the earth in, in a lot of big ways so something is here okay with uh, loyalty situations and being a person of integrity. This is my integrity card. So in the near future, there's going to be either be disappointment with the Five of Cups and somebody's not going to turn around, okay? And somebody's going to run or some type of quick communication or or somebody's going to communicate real quick and uh, turn around and take those cups, okay? that That's a forgiveness card. I guess it depends on any given person. What's hidden is some type of, you know, resting after a broken heart or somebody's trying to face the truth. It says truce. Uh, here, if there is some type of a medical situation here, somebody's went crazy or something got circulated around having circulation problems with them being under the knife, that card can go back to something like that. There's the Queen of That's amazing because we're the King and Queen of Pentacles. Now we're the king and queen of swords in y'all's reading. And that's interesting. We are looking at air and water, though. But there's loyalty situations that are going on. So this is resting after a broken heart. We did have the other man show up or something like that in that reading. And then somebody's you know, dealing with somebody that has went through either a divorce or something's happened with the pregnancy or something like that. Um, so we, you know, she's she just holding a mask. Cause this either somebody's pulling off a mask, or this person is has been wearing a mask. It's real sharp energy here. Let's take some words. Interesting. Somebody secretly, it is looking at the truth and balancing out the scales of truth. And the empress has the truth within her if she still got her values. Show me water and air, Yehovah. Okay, that's way too many. Way too many. Show me water and air. That just tells me that there's a, there's going to be a lot of communication here. Is what's coming through my spirit, how it, how it hit me, and it was impressed for your outcome. And you know, maybe disappointing, since it says disappointment, it's real quick communication. Or I'm leaving, or let's travel real quick, or this communication about an investigation is here, or it's it's quick and beautiful because somebody is resting secretly to, to close something out. Let's see, an offer or an offering energy. So there is a widow here. This card also came out in the air and fire, which is it, it, it's to blow the trumpet. So somebody was invaded back here real quick. Something happened. Something ended in the now about some ordeal where somebody died and I guess somebody got invaded there's an invasion type of energy and trumpets being blown and uh, people rushing in on yards or in fields or in villages and some type of protection around walls are showing up in this card so that those two cards came out with the widow and the blowing the trumpet and that other reading someone is guilty okay somebody is guilty of some, well again there was murder there 
Okay, so they sliced their arteries. I guess they did because they were in up a sacrificial stupid. And they did it on purpose. And it's known that they did. And I will say that another card came out um, that stated that everybody knows because something was made to come to the surface. And so this says they did it on purpose and it's known. And there's a consequence. The 12th house goes back to consequence. We've just seen the seven of cups at the bottom of the deck as well. And that is a consequence, what they did. Okay, so you, you just don't murder people. You just don't. You just don't freaking sit there and hang people up when you yourself would never do that crap. That's crazy. This crazy card. Somebody crazy. And that is a disappointing um, conversation. And we had a fugitive there. So in the future, somebody fixing to get up and run. I guess they're going to get up and run. You hope to show me uh, water and air. Or they've already ran and somebody's still having communication. For any given person, there's, there's already fugitives on the run. Um, a boss. Is it, well, this is a boss figure here as well with the world card. Security and organization. I will say that the four pentacles was there for the outcome. That's somebody that represents security and organization as well. Uh, it's a greed card though. We do have a lot of money involved in this stuff. We have uh, the bank systems here. She represents rich energy that's hidden around some situation. Some, some, type, some type of a huge heart issue around well, we had another man involved. Somebody's in love with somebody and something went down. We have X's out here, then, then something's out here. A judge. Well, somebody's guilty. Okay? Somebody's guilty. Some type of prison energy was back here with some situation. There is a baby here. Okay, well, the emperor, there's a secret baby as well, or secret babies, if we're dealing with sacrificing stuff. Uh, somebody has so much that they're going to tell somebody. What well, shows it right here? This is this is conversation here. And for some people, it's disappointing. And for some people, you know, that's healing because there's a forgiveness here as well. So the sacrifice of the wicked. This is sacrifices. The sacrifice of the wicked is an abomination. So how much more when they bring it with a wicked mind? We have wicked people out here, people, and, and they're, they're they're offering people and children. And thinking that the great one accepts that, and he says that's an abomination. That's disgust to him. Something around romance situations. But listen, people, if somebody's a liar and they just try to trap people in to do that crap, you really better make sure that they have the right conversation with you, man. Uh, we got freaks out here. Something about the tower is here. Uh, somebody was also told that, that somebody had time limit to make a quick decision. If they didn't make a decision, somebody was fixing to have a big old tower. Uh, and so we do have the tower energy here. Some some type of a trial is also here. Yes, there, if somebody's guilty, we have a judge out here. There there, there will be there will be something that would, that goes down. We got law that's secretly hidden for those empress energies that's in the upright because she represents law. Okay, uh, all the paths of Yehovah are mercy and truth. Unto such as keep his commandments and his testimony. For for thy namesake, pardon mine iniquity, for it is great. Now somebody did say, please forgive me. And so somebody was sorry, I'm sorry about something. Whatever that was alluding to and how far that goes, that's between you and, and the great one. A family member has been involved in something. Well, the Empress represents family, okay? Somebody has been watching for a long time, legal FBI, and so the, if that's positive and you're in the upright, then thank you for your service. Uh, whoso keeps his mouth and his tongue keeps his soul from troubles. Well, so obviously somebody didn't. Somebody went crazy back here. Uh, you know somebody who wears a girdle around them for strength or something to do with the belt issue could be here. We've got children and, and some, somebody went crazy. If somebody beat a child with the belt and somebody's loosened their belt. And we have that energy here because it's saying to remove a belt as well. So whatever this is coming out for, you hope it's bringing it out. We do have a truck here. Okay, well we have travel here in the now with the, with the world card. And we have travel here as well. So, somebody thinks that they're fixing to run because of some stupidness because of what is now known. Because you hope it's brought it out into to reading. Then somebody knows something. You hope it's brought something to surface. Show me um, outcome, please. Show me some more energy for outcome. What a shame. Uh, the priest is here. Okay, well, we got spirit. This, again, this is a spiritual type of an energy here. 
Okay, well, we have, we have, we have, we have spiritual matters going on. Uh, at the bottom of the deck, we have a dog. This is also go back to a friend could be involved. Um, actually, the scripture talks about they'd be eating the mice behind the groves and cutting off the dog's head. Okay? And spiritually speaking. So we got the dog out here. This also takes you back to like Phoenician God worship and stuff. So it would be here tied to spiritual matters since it's it's here. Prophecy is going on. Okay? Like we've never seen it before. It's just unfolded in front of our eyes. This is a positive card though to get in the deck. Okay? So, you know, this go back to... Um, a yes card it's a it's good news in this deck kind of a card as well so something is going to be good news especially those of you who are going to turn around and forgive and be spiritual and be upright those of you who are upright in your spirituality then that's here okay that's a, also a yes card we do have integrity showing here and secretly somebody's trying to rest after some death issue the four swords can also be death energy out here okay because we do have a widow out here as well Somebody's secretly a widow and they've been hiding that death, then there's something that there's something to that. Because something happened in the living room somewhere as well. If somebody's been missing or somebody's just been avoiding something or something like that, there, there could be somebody who's a secret widow. Uh, I, I'm not sure. That's just something that's come through my spirit, especially if they're going to get up and run or something like that. Um, whatever that is, something like that's come through my spirit. But we do have somebody wicked out here around some situation. Somebody's been investigated for a long time, it says. So we have the letter F coming out here. This also can go back to your offspring with children and stuff out here as well since the Empress is here. So um, this is something hidden is going to come to the light when it comes out. It's the Fihu. It's livestock. It's um, We actually have a picture of a livestock here as well. We have a cow here. Okay, so if somebody lives on a farm, I'll just bring that in here. Um, this is fraud issues when it's coming out. Somebody traded something, then I guess they did. Okay, so anyway, the letter F, the letter S, the letter L, the J, and uh, the G would be out here, and the H would be out here. I'll just take that for the high priest, okay, which would be the hay. Actually, the high priest for the water and um, fire reading was in this position here. So the priest would go back to that. Some type of revelation would be here, and this is something hidden that's coming to the, to the light. People, this is what come out for this reading. So there, there is something spiritual going on here. Somebody's praying at a pew. Uh, we do have people that are into the stupid, you know, Moloch, Phoenician God, whatever, sacrificing and worshiping stupidness. Somebody sitting here talking to a bold image as well. Somebody got looted on as well. This is a looting rune. We had a bunch of, you know, again, some, somebody's got fraud issues out here, okay? Something rightfully belongs to somebody, okay? There's been purchases and things like that, and then that's what that card is here for. Wow, what a reading. All right, people, well, this will come out for this, uh, for this reading between these two elements. Until next time, shalom.